what is going on our body Hello. it is pixel partners here and welcome back to rain code when we left off <laughs> we're getting down in the nitty-gritty this mystery is almost solved yeah you must come to the realization that we had for a while though the the, the, the way that went about was slightly different and that the uh was edgelord <laughs> Yeah, and then that, it was the uh, the homunculi that attacked in a rampage and massacred the entire city. But let's get to I the truth behind this all. I will shelter the mystery of Kanai Ward. Rawr! <laughs> Fighting stance. Rawr! rawr, rawr, rawr all right. <laughs> so intimidating. I didn't <laughs> Come at me! This tiny little. <laughs> Sorry, Yuma. Doesn't matter who you are, you're not intimidating. <laughs> uh. Uh. All right. Freezing deathmatch. So I don't know what he's going to argue for. Is he going to start with a repel? Nope. It's going to be something He's making up for his height by floating. Okay, keep <laughs> you keep telling me. Hold on. We've got the memo on corpse. Memo found in the, so that is about the WDO organization, that whole thing, the kidnappings. Mm -hmm. The doctor's confession. Uh, about the out of control defective homunculi and their characteristics. Um, this is that's uh, Vivia's one that talks about mm -hmm. uh, memory and their physical peculiarities. I'm just gonna listen in and see what he has to Tell say. Yeah. Something stands out. You telling me what? Swapping places is just in your head. Eh. Oh, oh, trick me. No proof a switch even took place. I don't know if I have proof on There's that, so I'm gonna wait. That. Look out. What? will destroy after the experiment. Um. Yeah, let's just listen through. The researchers who saw failures. Hmm. That's why it's impossible. That might be every. I would have attacked the city. Oh. Was killed by the homunculi. Oh well. Uh, it's in his video, so that yeah. uh, literally goes to show. So that, that that became real apparent, and then slash. Yep. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that one stood out from a mile away when we uh, saw that one. It's like, oh, there's literally the picture of him getting massacred. So. Yep. That's proof too. Dr. Yeah. Wesker left a video journal discussing the conclusions of Project Homunculus. It clearly showed the doctor dying at the hands of a defective homunculus who went out of control. Uh -huh. A few of them. He met the doctor yeah. at Amaterasu's lab, even though he should have been dead already. Yep. The fact that we met him after he died proves he and the other citizens were all replaced by homunculi. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> a... So the doctor at the lab was also a swapped out homunculus. That's why he didn't know about the results of the experiment. And also why he knew nothing about the blank week mystery. He didn't even remember the terrible things he did. He caused the city's greatest tragedy. But maybe what little conscience he had left urged him to leave evidence. Thank God for that. No, yeah. Not yet. Not yet. I refuse to give up. Oh. But it refused. <laughs> Determination. He's double sands right now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, I just said that. <laughs> Oh man, a comparison that I doubt any. Well, I don't know. Maybe someone's made that comparison I have before. To protect Kanai Ward. Why does the other master want to protect Kanai Ward so badly? Oh, oh. You don't fully understand it yet. You know nothing about Kanai Ward. What do you know about its darkness? Uh, it's from the rain. Total edgelord. <laughs> oh, God. Hey, he's got the gun. Was there for unending raining con I ward? Um. Master, it's rainy season. I'd cut up the. No. Uh. That, yeah. Okay, I had to remember what Y was, and I got Whoa, it this time. We I'm just learning. Fucking... That it. Damn. You ever just whack a bullet back? <laughs> covered con I ward to block out sunlight. Block out the sun. Which homunculi are vulnerable to. The homunculi stopped their attack thanks to the clouds covering the city. Oh yeah, keep running, little bitch. Master, All right. Don't let him get away. You gotta finish <clears throat> this. That hypocrite. I'll expose him for who he is. I wonder why he had that gun. You're not done yeah. <laughs> the city's darkness goes even deeper. Oh, we're kind of we're dead end up. That's going to be the funeral hall. <laughs> <Not> the answer. <laughs> uh, 
I obviously didn't select funeral uh, hall, everyone. Yeah, no. <laughs> I know it doesn't show the thing very quickly, but the abandoned village, a restricted area. Whenever a defective homunculus revives, its intelligence decreases, turning it into a zombie. The city would have been overrun with zombified homunculi if the bodies were left alone. That's why the bodies have been getting sent to the abandoned village. Peacekeepers always tried to get rid of the bodies as fast as possible. Did they know they'd turn into zombies? No, they were probably just following orders. They were told that bodies in this city rot quickly. The people of Kanai Ward, including the peacekeepers, didn't know that they're all homunculi. It must also be the reason why they were so strict about keeping this place isolated it's from the outside world. It's a very convenient <laughs> excuse. All the rain makes them rot yeah. faster. Hurry up. Nowhere to go. <laughs> Except down, bitch. Because you're going down. down. I jumps. told you, that's not me! <laughs> you think that's enough to defeat me? Yes. You think that's enough to expose Kanai Ward's darkness? Almost. <laughs> more, 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 more! Can I watch the darkness goes far, 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 far deeper than that? You good? <laughs> um. Uh. No. All right, what is the source? Fishing for kind of always. Meat buns. Meat buns. <laughs> Rainwater. <laughs> oh, man. As fucked up as this is. Uh -huh. And the fact that means that we ate people before, but... Hey. That's right. The people in Kanai Ward love their meat buns. You know what they're made of, don't you? Hopes and dreams. <laughs> Technically. The main source <laughs> of nutrients for homunculi is human flesh. That's why everyone craved those meat buns so much. Yay. <laughs> Warning. Homunculi are predisposed to eating human flesh in order to maintain the artificial organic synthesis in their cells. Currently, there are no Why is there alternate sources marks? of nutrition, and they grow sick if they do not consume human flesh. I think it's because it came off of the note technically, yeah. and those usually go towards the person that yeah. attributed the note That's to it. That's a primal oh, okay. instinct homunculi can never defy. What are you? Mystery phantoms are supposed to prevent mysteries from being exposed. And yet, it's like you're guiding me to the truth. <laughs> it's not just the meat buns. Residents of Kanai Ward also have other characteristics. Of course, I'm sure you've already noticed them. Uh, uh, why are you a uh, giant bomb? Okay. Bomb? He's trying to boom kill you, <laughs> but you can defuse it by solving the mystery. You've seen it time and time again. You should already know this. Their physical abnormalities. It's another part of Kanai Ward's darkness. Is it the blood? Is it the blood? Bodies? Let's go, Master. We gotta join hands and defeat my other Master. Come on, I want to be right about this too. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. Let me say wayo. Wayo. Um. Okay. Uh, p p Pink p blood. P yes. Great. Oh, I'm, I'm so, I'm so smart. I'm so smart. I mean, we had a feeling that was gonna be the blood here, but I'm just. Well, I'm pretty sure point. I'm the one that thought of it, though. I'm the one that said something first, anyway. I'm pretty sure. I think it both came like because I remember I did, 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 did my brain. It's been a long day, but <laughs> we're getting somewhere. Aww. That one's a used one before, cute. but it's still cute. Yeah. Um. Boom kill the boom kill. <sighs> but normally that would make it explode. My eyes, Jesus Christ. Shot, yeah. Why was that so flashy? Oh. Blasting off again! <laughs> huh? Pink 
blood? <laughs> hey, everyone did have pink blood. I think I got too used to it. <laughs> <laughs> now that I think about it, it's really abnormal. Blood being pink instead of red is obviously strange. <laughs> now he's right. only just now questioning it. From the beginning, it. I thought something was off. Since I first saw a corpse in this city, I had my suspicions about the color of the blood here. Is that a real corpse? It's not some mannequin, is it? This blood is real? How so that's why you said it that way. Yeah. So he did I question it. I it was due to Shinigami haunting me. <laughs> like he was somehow changing the way I see things. That's How valid. That's valid, out. though. Yeah. <laughs> Shinigami, you don't feel anything after seeing this body? Uh... You're asking me how I feel about death? Well, That's not what I mean! You, this is totally ordinary! I believed you! I was just saying there was nothing odd about there being a corpse. The color of human blood doesn't matter to me. But, but why didn't the other master detectives mention anything about the color? It wasn't mentioned at all while I was investigating crime scenes with Halara. Oh, yeah. Oh, right! Maybe... The rain sure has changed things around here, both the city and the people, too. Supposedly, there's something in the rain that messes with our bodies and the environment, but it's all hearsay. It could be because Chief Yako said the rain affects things. In fact, maybe it wasn't just the master detectives. Chief Yako and the other people in town, maybe they all believed it, too. For example, they could have said there were some chemical properties in the rain that causes blood to change color. In that case, people wouldn't find it strange that their blood was pink. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Yes, homunculi have pink blood. Maybe they were made that way to differentiate them from their originals. I just had, I, like, I know the game is going off. I had a really... I know I'm going maybe way too far with this, but my head cannons oh are incredible, okay? Here we go. Because, you know, I was talking what about this time? the UG doing experimentation with fantastic, talented people. And if, you know, Dog and Rumpel, everyone that has pink blood, and, you know, all that. Uh huh. Now then, our Makoto over here, and if Makoto is <laughs> a clone of us, oh, no. broke out. <laughs> of the testing facility, and I want you spoiler alert to Duncan Ronpa, especially V3. Jesus Christ, Evan. If you think about who broke out and who they ironically sound a little bit like, because it's the same voice actor. Um if if they are a copy of Yuma, because Yuma is the is the voice actor of uh, Kiba. I'm just putting it out there, baby. Okay. Yeah. Anyways. You're finally <laughs> seeing the big picture. It's like he's talking to you. <laughs> I've been waiting for this. Master's mystery phantom sure doesn't seem scared of these mysteries being solved. Yeah. Normally they're like, no, no, no. <sighs> anyway, we gotta beat him. Otherwise, you'll get caught in its destruction. Fine. Let's end this. It's time to expose the truth of Kanai Ward's ultimate secret. It's over! <laughs> you? You think you can do it? Hmm. I'm very intrigued as to why... Or is this just to make a... Are you making a book? Mm -hmm. We're making a book. Okay. Nope. All for those corpses, man. Rip corpses. <laughs> it's only five pages, thank God. <laughs> yeah. It's like here, on one here's last time. the summary of the plot of the game. <laughs> <sighs> Pretty much. All right, so we have the rain cloud generator. On award 10 years ago. It was being researched. Not that. Uh, this would be towards the end for the rain Ooh, cloud generator. Oh, that angle. Look at that. It's so creepy. <laughs> Um, okay, so that's the rain cloud generator yep. there. Um, what's this? Come on, guy! Now that's what was being studied. Yep. Um, alright, now I have everything here. If I've got, uh, what was used to, as an excuse to click DNA, 
Is that a blood test right there? My eyes are so fucking good, dude. <laughs> I can read fucking 20 pixels. Uh, who directed that? I see your face from a mile away. Yep. Dr. Wesker. Wesker. I know, I just like being fun with it. <laughs> and then... Give me that last one. Sunlight. <laughs> Perfect. Read the book, baby. D We've solved the mystery. That was easy. <laughs> All right. Uh... Now, from the top. And that's a wrap, folks. I do these recaps out of kindness, you know. I'm just saying, it'd be nice to get a little appreciation. Love you, baby. Yay. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I thought this was all a part of your process or something. <laughs> anyway, time to boom kill this mystery phantom. Let's expose all the facts and finish this once and for all. It's time for the very last deduction denouement. Hey, he said it now. Hmm? You. It all together. started 10 years ago. The UG tasked both its own research facility and Amaterasu Corp to conduct homunculus research. They were trying to create an immortal army of homunculi that could just come back to life, right? If that happened, the Death Gods would be out of a job! <laughs> By having the two organizations compete with each other, they hoped to rush development along. And it was the UG's research facility that managed to create a homunculus first. That drove Amaterasu into a panic. Okay, so, thank you. <laughs> three years ago, Project Homunculus was conducted under Dr. Weska's direction. Acting like they were just Ugh. testing for a contagious disease, they took blood from all the people in Kanai Ward. They were turning the town upside down, trying to find DNA that would help them make homunculi. Homunculi. They got beat to the punch and were rushing for results. You look at the sun. You ask me. Hmm. Look at all these Ultimately, real people. The experiment was a failure, and their efforts resulted in nothing more than a mass of defective homunculi. Defective homunculi have two fatal flaws. One, they revive after death with fully repaired bodies, but their minds deteriorate and they become zombies. Two, sunlight whips them into a bloody frenzy, but they won't remember what they did afterwards. It's kind of like when an alcoholic corporate drone with a lot of pent-up stress gets a picture at the company party. God. All right. I'm not sure that's really the same. <laughs> uh. Oh, man. Anyway, That'd be terrifying. Yeah. Jesus. Yeah, there's all the real blood. Sunlight and immediately went on a rampage. I want to know... <laughs> Okay, it's just lighting. I was like, why is the dinosaur got pink? I'm used to the blood being pink, but yeah, there's a uh, there's regular blood massacre all yep. over the place. They attacked Kanai Ward and murdered all of the residents. A certain masked man then created a rain cloud generator by making some extreme modifications to a public bathhouse. Wasn't me. <laughs> he covered the whole city with those clouds. The rain clouds blocked out the sun and brought the defective homunculi out of their berserk state. Their memories reverted back to when their blood had been drawn one week before. The blank week mystery refers to the period where they went out of control and lost their memories. So trippy. So basically, the <laughs> Hanai Ward's ultimate secret is... Three years ago, the defective homunculi of all Kanai Ward residents murdered their human counterparts. Exposed to sunlight at the very moment of their creation, they went berserk and wiped out the entire city. <laughs> Rain clouds then blocked out the sun, and their human memories returned. The defective homunculi have no idea they're not human. And they continue on to this day in this land of never-ending rain. They just live their lives, happily munching away on human flesh-filled buns. God. Pink blood wasn't caused by the rain. It's actually conclusive evidence that every resident is a homunculus. We've done it. <laughs> this is the truth behind Kanai Ward's ultimate secret. <laughs> oh 
Whoa. Huh. That wasn't from me. No. Well. Hi. <laughs> hey, friend. <laughs> Friendo. You ever, Buddies. you ever just throw a sword? Pow. Oh, man. This is going to be a tense Also, showdown. isn't there a thing where only Yuma can use the sword? Thought so, but... It's you. Hey. You finally made it. I've been waiting for you. I also thought of something what? that I was going to say as we were going into the denouement, but then I got distracted by all that of one last theory because the game's going to solve itself here, but just in case I have something going for it. I have a thought uh -huh. that can kind of simplify things as to us being like the son of number one because He's hear me so out. old though. Wouldn't it be grandson? Now... What if that wasn't always number one? Mm. What if we were number one with the greatest mind? I remember you saying that before. I think early on I had the thought like, oh, well, we're number one. But now like there's actually context to make a serious assumption on that. Mm -hmm. That we were number one, got cloned, our clone broke out and went wild. And we were like, hold up. I need to fix this, but maybe I can't do it right with all my memory. I need so a we death blocked gun. out our memories, <laughs> grab the book of death that we knew could be a way to solve this, wash our memories, and then we arrived here and we had someone else take up the helm of number one mm -hmm. after that. So Makoto was a clone of us and we are originally number one. Huh. But I also had a thought of about Makoto being so dead so you set think Makoto's on... Makoto's like our homunculus. Yes, yeah. I th I've always been on the track, but yeah. he is a clone of us, and that's why he's in here and confident, well, and he threw that sword. The proper term is homunculus, not clone. They're yeah, two different I mean. things. But, kind of. about Makoto being so cocky and being, you know, <laughs> our twinsy, um, what if we don't know how this is going to play out? Because if our own homunculus did a crime and we go through the mystery labyrinth is that going to go towards the homunculus or does it go towards the owner of the soul and DNA hmm. like has Makoto tricked us to be like oh you found it by the way you've killed yourself because you are my body you are the owner you are the soul you're gonna die now because this is your fault by DNA standards. I don't know. That Let's find out. Like this guy's the mystery phantom now. I figured he'd show up eventually. I think that might be why he's so cocky is that he's going mm -hmm. to kill us and take the helm of the original Except spot. he's not a mystery phantom. He's the real him. He's just been hiding. No, I know. But no, they don't know. She, she doesn't uh, know. Yeah. That's what I'm pointing out. You sure out. took a while getting here. Maybe I shouldn't expect much of you. Oh boy. Hmm. Is that a solution blade? Huh? Why does he have a solution blade? We shall see which of us should be destroyed. Let's wield our solution blades to find the answer. Um. Sword fight. <laughs> oh, but, um. Don't tell me. You didn't assume you already arrived at the truth, did you? A B Y X A B Y X. Okay. <laughs> you promised you would expose all truth. Is this really the best you can do? Ooh, that sound well, they're making. Perhaps you're not as capable as I thought. How did you get that solution blade? Oh yeah. You should be more curious. After all, you understand nothing about me. For I am Kanai Ward's ultimate secret. <laughs> It's like, wait, I, I thought I had to Master can even uh -oh. make snap judgments. No. Battle of Mystery Phantom Makoto. Do you want to read one last <laughs> tutorial? <laughs> this won't let up, huh? You still remember how to deal with this kind of situation, don't you? If the answer isn't right, just wait it out and get ready for the next attack. Why would they make Y the button? It's the button on the left. Why? That makes no sense it's the button, but fine. It's, <laughs> it's fine. All right, so. You, you're the ultimate secret? First... 
When did I come to Kanai War? Oh well. I mean, technically, are we going to three years? Can you yeah. Yeah. That? But watch us get tricked on that one. Uh, three, three years, years ago. ago. Meow. Uh, what was happening kind of when Makoto arrived? Um. No. Nope. Weak mystery. Nope. Oh, it was the blank weak uh, mystery yeah. as that one passed. But. Ouch. Because, yeah, that was ongoing when he was here. So. Yeah. yeah. All right, try that this again. This music is dope, though. It is. All right. Dodge. Punch bow! Ooh. Fuck you. Oh boy. <laughs> yes, that's it. Ooh. Oh, he's switching out his yeah, mask. Remember, he has like 10 different ones, I think. <laughs> I came he was to like 30. <laughs> during the blank week mystery three had 10. years ago. All to resolve that case. Resolve that case? I knew they'd regain control once sunlight was blocked. So, I created the rain cloud generator to gently cover Kanai Warden Rain. It's more like you caged them in. Yep. Without me, Kanai Ward would never have been rebuilt. I used everything at my disposal to cover up the tragedy that took place here. But there was no way for me to fix the entire city on my own. Why did you do it? Why do such a thing? You want to know? I did it to protect Kanai Ward, of course. Because I love this city. And why do you love it so much? He never stops saying that. I do anything for it. But you already know. This music that. has paranormal sight vibes. <laughs> and I love that. What do we go to do to protect Kanai Ward? Uh which kind of question are you asking me? Um isolation. isolation. So that no one would discover them. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Nice. And you you call that protecting them? You trapped them. Yeah, put another one on. Yellow. That right, creepier smile. Was it? I don't remember being that jagged, but I could be wrong. Ward would have been wiped from the map. It's very toothy. <laughs> the UG planned to flatten Kanai Ward to cover up the failed homunculus experiment. But thanks to my negotiating, they saw the benefits of isolation. We would peacefully secure the defective homunculi, and they wouldn't have to spend a cent. Besides, it'd be a terrible thing if the UG's inhumane research was made public. And through that negotiating, you became CEO of Amaterasu Corporation. Your goal Come was to rule over eyes. Kanai Ward, yeah. wasn't it? Everyone's watching this finale. Ooh. <laughs> you still don't understand me. Try to remember. Hey, Master. There's something weird about this mystery phantom. And he's not Why a phantom. Why are we able to talk to him like this? None of the others acted this way. Huh? They don't know he waltzed in, yeah. so... <laughs> Try to remember. What did I do after I became CEO of Amaterasu Corporation? Um. I said, don't come. I said, no, I think that's been there. And it's right there. Yeah, I missed it. Dang it, Evan. Didn't dissolve the beastkeepers. Don't worry, I now know. It always takes such quick reactions on it, okay. so. Okay. Fast forward, please. Faster, faster, faster. And hop up. There you go. End of the research. Sorry, I'm a pal. <laughs> Steve, no. I'd like to believe that Steve is okay and uh, doing <laughs> peacefully in retirement. research. <laughs> I didn't want to create any additional defective homunculi, so I ended the research and sealed off the test site. Doctor Weska and Yomi objected. But as the CEO, I was able to quash their complaints. Huh. With a little bloosh. On the mouth. <laughs> Tongues off to the That's sides this time. I rebuilt Kanai Ward all on my own. It is a city for homunculi who have nowhere else to go. It's like the little <laughs> thing. Yeah. You did it to protect the people in the city? 
That's right. I did it all out of the love I have for this place. That is the undeniable truth. I've never hid my love for Kanai Ward from you at any moment. No? Yet, you never quite seem convinced about it. What he says makes sense. He's not lying. The experiment created the defects, so we transformed Kanai Ward to protect them. They're not monsters. But if <laughs> that's true, what crime is he guilty of? Why have I drawn my sword against him? Because he kidnapped people to feed them. Yeah. Hey, Master! Don't let that mystery phantom fool you! Try to remember why he started this in the first place! He's a phantom! He's just trying to prevent you from exposing the truth! He's not a phantom. <laughs> yeah, you're right. You just play He's like any no old safe. day. He's a dictator who will do anything to achieve what he wants. He's going to find that entertaining. Yeah. <laughs> oh, boy. What crime did Mikoto commit? Destroy the detective agency. Ah, well, he didn't do that. I was thinking... So. Why'd you hit it? <laughs> well, like I said, he was. I thought he was responsible for the bombing in some way. But let's yeah, see. But, let's but, so you, you literally just said the murders of all those people, the kidnappings. <laughs> all right. So let's wait. Destroy the detective agency. Oh, it's the first person who's throwing me off, too. Uh, maybe I'm trying to do his own. No. no. Mass kidnapping. Oh. oh. Is it just the one or all of them? You may wear the mask of a oh, sex, I see a nose. But it can't yeah. hide the crimes you've committed. You are the mastermind behind the global kidnapping case the WDO has been pursuing. People were abducted across the world and turned into food for homunculi at your factory. That is a crime. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty unforgivable. Oh, he's got one to put on. How and convenient. It. Whoa. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. I had no choice. That's terrifying. They must eat in order to survive. It's ironically quite like the homunculi when they go berserk. Yeah. Besides, they never took innocent people. I that gathered is true. criminals with no chance of rehabilitation. They simply accelerated their sentencing. Also, if we were number one and he looks like number one, then that would be why people would be like, I can't believe that number one did this if he looked exactly like us during their kidnapping. Mm. You saw the memo as well. Besides, they were all on death row anyway. That doesn't make it right. At any rate, that's not just my crime. Huh? The procurement of these ingredients was done with the full cooperation of the World Detective Organization. God, look at that in that shot. <laughs> I couldn't have asked for a better source of information for the ingredients. You were working with the World Detective Organization? Actually, it's more accurate to say I took advantage of them. Liar! The WDO wouldn't let themselves be used by you! You just flaunted their name to capture criminals! In fact, the WDO itself tasked us with investigating the global kidnapping case! Yeah, that's what I was if saying you before. you were their accomplice, they wouldn't have issued that directive! And we would never have come to Kanai Ward to corner you like this! You still think you've got me cornered? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you really are clueless. Oh boy. The way I see it, you were all gathered at Kanai Ward for other reasons. Ooh, this uh, funky okay. music. Well, go on and use that simple brain of yours to expose my schemes. Master detectives were assembled. Uh, to wipe out the master detectives. Oh. To oust Yomi. I'll just because that's usually the last one, so that's it's not it. It's Yomi. It has to be Yomi. <laughs> it could be a conspiracy really of sorts. So come on, come on, come on, faster now. Quiet, hush, hush, hush. <laughs> but faster, please. Don't. You're taking up all my time. You didn't have to have the reset point be that far back. All right, I've got the mass tech techniques. Yep. Bye, Yomi. <laughs> You used us. 
The whole you thing at the secret lab. mysteries of other global cases to lure us to Kanai Ward. Your true goal was to cast out Yomi, director of the Peacekeepers, since he was in your way. Correct. Well, almost. You're so close. Yomi wasn't in my way. He was in Kanai Ward's way. If all he did was use the Peacekeepers to push his weight around, that would have been fine. But of all things, he was working with Dr. Weska, trying to leak homunculus information. True, he was trying mm. to get the truth of this place out. If that happened, the unified government wouldn't remain silent. Kanai Ward's secrets would be exposed to the world. And everything that he'd Still, been working towards would have been destroyed. I expel yeah. him myself. The Peacekeepers had grown too strong in this city. You pitted us against the Peacekeepers, and you got what you wanted by eliminating Yomi. So what were we gathering here? It was all part of that mask guy's plan? Because you achieved your goal, you're trying to eliminate us? Now that we've outlived our usefulness? Ooh, there's the pink Ooh. blood. It is indeed pink. What? What happened to the other master detectives? And she's like, wait, that's yeah. not a that's not Are a phantom. You the one who bombed WDO <laughs> headquarters? Oh my Whoa. god. That's terrifying and I love it. <laughs> this is kind of cool though. <laughs> they knew too much. I feel remorse for what had to be done. But the WDO was in the city's way. In the way? I had no choice. This city must remain a secret in order to survive. Having detectives snoop around everywhere was a nuisance. That's why I made them disappear. You'll pay for this. Talking to a mystery phantom might be pointless, but I swear you'll regret this. If he knew uh, he was master. real, he probably wouldn't have slashed him like that. You are Maybe he would have. I don't know. You used the WDO and slaughtered criminals like animals. You even killed my friends. For all the crimes you've committed, I'll bury your soul here. <laughs> I didn't expect to hear something so valiant from the likes of you. We finally put our big boy pants on. Yeah. <laughs> do you really think you can do this? You're nothing but an empty shell of a man. Ironic coming from you. <laughs> So unless we are clone too. Mm -hmm. But we had Redbug. Yep. Master, don't let him egg you on. It's a trap. There's something off about this mystery phantom. He doesn't seem normal. Well, he's more normal than you can imagine. Yeah. <laughs> he he's bleeding. Uh-huh. Um. Hmm. Oh dear. Ugh. What a smile. Master, master. <laughs> master of puppets. Stop. No. What is this, New Year's what, Eve? What huh? is this? I'm not seeing enough movement. <laughs> People of Kanai Ward. They're all mystery phantoms. There's too many of them. I've never seen anything like this. All of them? Kanai Ward must remain shrouded in mystery for everyone here to live in peace. Even they haven't realized they are homunculi yet. No, they must never know. It would be too cruel a fate. Their very existence is this city's mystery. They are the mystery? Take a good look. Aren't they pitiable? They're labeled as defective and must continue to live in a land without sun. You made them that way! To protect them! Mm -hmm. All of this was to protect them. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> Do you understand how much I've endured for them? I've committed atrocities to keep them fed. If any died, they were swiftly taken to the abandoned village. When anyone asked about the color of their blood, 
I said it was caused by the rain. This is all for their sake! I did it for them! They're outcasts from this world who can only survive within a cage of rain! <sighs> Master, don't start feeling sorry for phantoms. We're still inside the mystery labyrinth. This is not a phantom! <laughs> if you can't solve the mystery, you'll be absorbed by the labyrinth and your soul will vanish. I know. I've already made up my mind. I will expose the truth. Uh... uh. Master's mystery phantom is back? <laughs> this must be a mystery phantom created from your reluctance. My Familiar with that. Yeah. What good will come from solving Whoa. mysteries? Who would be made happy by this? I'm finally tall. <laughs> Shut up! God How it. many people have died because of the mysteries I've solved? He's oh, I don't need to be that tall. It's due to your uncertainty. Why must mysteries be exposed? Why can't you just leave them alone? I didn't belong in this city in the first place. Master! It's true. I still don't know what's right. But I will fight. I'll fight against my uncertainty. I won't let any mystery phantom deceive me! If you've draped this city in mystery, then I will unveil it with the truth! <laughs> okay. <laughs> really? You think you've got what it takes? Yes. Well mm. said, Master. But what mystery do I even solve here? There's still one unanswered question. It's about him. You still haven't confirmed his true identity. Who is he? Who? Makoto? That's true. I still don't know who he really is. I've never seen the face beneath his mask. Oh yeah. boy. You're right. I have to figure out who he is. Thank you, Shinigami. It's my job to keep you relying on me, Master. <laughs> You've got quite a capable assistant. Oh, mighty detective. I hope she doesn't end up becoming your burden. Just stop. There's no need for the truth. The truth isn't needed in this city. Let's do some deep cleaning on that stupid-looking oversized trash. Hey, hey that's still me. Again with that? Come on. It's like, please, okay, I thought we had me. something. Let's lay it all out. All right. Into the barrel one last time. Looking down the barrel of a bikini. <laughs> Barrel of a barrel. Oh, it's nightime now. Okay. Ho. <laughs> oh, what is. Ho, oh. He's ho. Ho. <laughs> Correct. We're done. <laughs> I'm wait, sorry. That wait, was too funny. Wait. wait. <laughs> or is it MA? I thought. Or... Nice. Ho. Mu. Nice. <laughs> Us. <laughs> Ugh. Homosexuals. <laughs> I I forgot how it was spelled, so I was hoping it was gonna be whole mon two lies. So I could, I could have no. the first one be homo, and now I'd be like, perfect. Screen cap that. <laughs> you know the rainbow eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Okay. Respectfully. <sighs> smash. Next. Okay. Wrong series. Okay. Also smash. <laughs> I would smash, sell my soul to the book, lose my memory, <coughs> and smash again. I choked on my G fuel. <coughs> See that? That's what the you get. The reason you're so desperate to defend the <coughs> honor ward is because you're also a homunculus. That's why the blood you shed earlier. It was instant karma. Ladies. Was pink. It was instant karma. Yeah. <laughs> the color of your blood <clears throat> proves it. Makoto Kagutsuchi, you are a homunculus. Of who? <laughs> no. Stop. If you expose anything else, 
You're gonna regret you it. You will only be hurting yourself. Huh? <laughs> you are so close. Come on. Nice. Back to You're the original. Within reach of my mask. Ugh. Away where? Where was he born? Okay, did you no. hit that? I did. Why? Uh, I'm gonna look for uh, UG. Why would you do that? <clears throat> you are so uh, because close. I've, I'm dumb. Come on. <laughs> Listen, this, in these moments of pressure, I see things and I react. Yeah, but there's choices, like a, Evan. I react like an alligator. If something pops on my mouth, I'm like, come on. There's choices. All right, it's uh, gonna be the UG facility. Nope. Yes. Yep. There we go. Ooh. Oh, give it a crack. And it's, it's going to be like of the who. Gonna... It's going to wait for it's going to do a going to be a probably a rule of 3 I'll assume. You yeah. saved Kanai Ward during the blank week mystery and you were able to move about unaffected by sunlight. Which means you're not a defective homunculus. Mhm. Mm what else? <laughs> 3 years ago, right before you came to Kanai Ward, a homunculus escaped from the UG's research facility. It was the only perfect homunculus specimen. That's what you are! Yes, keep going. You can reach my mask if you just go a bit further. It almost looked like he leaked Dodo's DNA is based on number one. Yep. Number one. This is not his next door. Stop. <laughs> And then it's gonna become the big question: Perfect Who is number one? Was based on the DNA of the WDO's number one. Therefore, you must be the homunculus of number one, Makoto Kagutsuchi. He's a copy of number one. We are number one. Okay. He doesn't look like the number one <clears throat> we saw. So maybe his youth was restored when he became a homunculus. Unless, <laughs> if you looked just like number one. It'd be easy for you to manipulate the WDO from the shadows. That's how you procure dangerous criminals as food for the homunculi here, isn't it? I see. Number one. So that's my identity, huh? Right, right. Things are turning out as I expected. It's so refreshing when things go as you plan. Planned? But it's not over yet. You're still not done. You still haven't seen it! What's with him? No matter how many mysteries I solve, it doesn't face him. Master, I'm sorry, but this... This could be really bad. <laughs> this isn't huh? actually... What's that <laughs> supposed to mean? Something strange about this phantom. There's still something more to him. What is he hiding? It just feels off. For now, oh, uh, let's give it to figure me. it all out. Concentrate, Master. Oh, come on. <laughs> come on. Spot, Spot selection. selection. Ident what identify feels what out feels place? out of place. The blood. I mean, well, no, the blood is because we know he's a homunculi, so that's not it. I no, think the fact that he's bleeding, like, come, the because remember she's like blood. Okay, See? fair. I'm tr I'm trying to be too far ahead. No, because they don't bleed normally. The, yeah, I think it's about the fact that phantoms. he. I think that's. Yeah. Hopefully, yeah. we're on the same thought process. Because mm -hmm. I am like ahead of the game, and everything I'm trying to solve. Mm -hmm. But it's like, why are you bleeding? Yeah, that is a suspicious spot. <laughs> That was a weird way to do it. <laughs> yeah. Speaking of which, that wound. Why is he still bleeding? All the other mystery phantoms I struck with the solution blade never bled like this. So, why? He's not a mystery phantom. Huh? I'm sure of it. He wasn't created by the mystery labyrinth. Oopsie. <laughs> That's the real Makoto? I hurt someone! <laughs> it took you long enough to figure that out. Oh, mighty detective. How did you enter the mystery labyrinth? 
through the portal. I'm getting bored of all this talk. Let's finish things. I wonder if he has a clone, if he would, like, if he was a clone and we kind of shared things, then that means that he would have our capabilities if the pact was made with, you know, mm -hmm. Shinigami, then Next that's why he can I'll just kind of walk in and get his own force. blade. This will decide Kanai Ward's fate. Okay. Only one of us will leave here alive. Oh, God. Tell me your answer! Um. Master, you can't just go take a swing at him! We're inside the mystery labyrinth, so you have to solve mysteries! What mysteries? How a living person could make it inside here! You just might defeat him by answering that question! Alright, I'll try! Alright, what presentation are they doing? Mystery labyrinth. Shinigami's um. power? No, I guess it. I guess it'd be similar to coalescence, but yes. coalescence is weird. That good bio is cool. <laughs> what was the one on the right? I'm gonna try It's gonna be coalescence, because that's what they've always used before. But whoa! Oh god, the solution that we just solutionception. <laughs> I need to remember the exact rules of coalescence. You have to be holding hands. When someone uses their... He did grab our hand Only before coming over the machine, the remember? The can enter the yeah, but you have to be holding it actively during it. Remember this? We had not we had, could never let go hands with um, Halara during the things. We could never let yeah. go hands with uh, fucking... Uh, well, let's, let's, with uh, Fubuki. That's about sharing theirs. But yeah. then we, it's anyone that we've shared one with that then is welcome inside the mystery labyrinth. Mm -hmm. The last one we shared one with, I think that was it, because that's why Fubuki didn't come again in chapter four, because yeah. that reset when we connected with Vivian. Because they did straight up zoom in on that hand grab. As the they one did. Who made the pact, those whose hands I've held with my coalescence can also enter the mystery labyrinth. And since coalescence <laughs> is a passive thing, it, nothing would have happened when you- Master, when did you use coalescence with him? Well, that's the strange part. I've never used coalescence with him. He doesn't have any ability I'd want to borrow to begin with. Then how? Let's see if you can overcome that mystery. I think that would be him. Uh-huh. This is it. Yep. didn't use coalescence and yet Makoto was able to enter the mystery labyrinth. What if he has a book too? What if he has a Shinigami too on his side right now talking to him? So then we would see her. Well, if, 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 if he can't see ours, we can't see his. No, he can see so, ours. So, Makoto used coalescence on me? He has the same power? Everyone else who used coalescence could see too. <gasps> That's right. You got it. I used coalescence on you earlier. We should turn off the alarm before we celebrate our reunion. Aren't you worried about Kurumi's body? Here. Lend me a hand. Yep. I said, lend me a hand. And then you did. That was when you allowed me to activate coalescence. But why are you able to use it? That power belongs to Shinigami! That's where you're mistaken. Coalescence isn't Shinigami's power. It's ours! It's her forte. Coalescence is the forte yep. of the World Detective Organization's number one. There it is! <laughs> number one's forte? We are number one. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> if it's not Shinigami's power, then <laughs> how do you use it? Yuma. Yuma. Guess what? And she probably knows because yeah. she <laughs> remembers Shinigami? things from before the pack. Why aren't you saying anything? Hey, we're number what? one. Are you hiding? <laughs> He was number one! Seven, I swear to God, <laughs> I'm, stop. I'm sorry, I'm memeing <laughs> so hard before I get serious. You're memeing too hard. Promised? I promised you I wouldn't remind you. It's the end for you if you can't figure this out. I will end you! Holy shit! Whoa. 
Okay, 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 okay. Why am I able to use number one's forte? Why would Shinigami hide that from me? Wait, could it be? Is this related to my lost memories? You're there. That must mean my you true must true identity. identity. Is... Number one, Death God. Stop <laughs> saying it that way. Perfect homunculus was based on the DNA of the WDO's number one. Therefore, you must be the homunculus of number one, Makoto Kagutsuchi! Oops, that was cool. <gasps> <gasps> That's terrifying. Why is he hot though? <laughs> How did that happen? What? <laughs> Character design's a bitch. <laughs> That's it's literally the same face. What are you talking about? So you finally reached the conclusion. Behold, the truth that you've been seeking all along. You are number one from the WDO, and I'm the homunculus created from your DNA. He changed his voice all of a sudden. Yeah. Number one of the World Detective Organization? That's why I can also use your coalescence. His voice did straight Even up change. The yeah. Mission blade was obtained with this power. But, but this looks like a pretty boy to me. Feed, mm -hmm. Number one looks like an old man. That was a double. You're the one who put him there. Throughout the history of the WDO, those who become number one have rarely shown their faces to the public. They all had many enemies, making it problematic to be seen. It's standard protocol for directors to have doubles. And that old man was your double. Wait, what about me being a detective in training? Chief Yako said he investigated my background. We were number one, we can do anything, dude. Yeah. <laughs> but a detective in training was also summoned. Detective in training? That's you, Yuma. Looks like you've been working toward being a detective at the WDO. You may be part of the organization, but you haven't earned your stripes just yet. It's true that there is a trainee detective by the name of Yuma Cocohead. You killed him. It's <laughs> also a fact that he was summoned to the Amaterasu Express. Then... You swapped places with the person named Yuma. I swapped with him? It seems he also came to Kanai Ward. I'm sure you've met with him several times. Oh! So, I'm not Yuma? Then the real Yuma Coco Head. It's the guy in the soba shop. <laughs> <laughs> Whoop! Who gave up their identity as Yuma Coco Head? Oh. Wow. Interesting. <sighs> oh, this is like, <laughs> dude, this is just, I'll go this is, right, so. again. Who, <laughs> the picture frames? Who, who's the blackened? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, Shinigami, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Kurumi, no, she's a monkey alive. from here. Yeah. Pretty sure. And it showed her in the in the whole yeah. montage, yeah. Kodo, that makes no sense. Yomi, <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Martina Electro, that doesn't make sense. Number one, doesn't make any sense. Boy. <laughs> Boy. <laughs> the ramen guy. <laughs> yeah, the robot researcher, even though he had an image, doesn't make sense. I'm gonna throw the ramen at the at the wall, see if it fucking sticks. Oh, I'm going to assume that's a yes. Otherwise, I just lost the entire game. <laughs> oh my god.
I assume that was it. Yeah. <clears throat> was the man who kept running from me? That's correct. You are number one of the WDO after all. He's quit his job as a detective and opened up a food stand in Kanai Ward. He's the real trainee detective, Yuma Cocohead. You concealed your true identity and used him as a means to enter Kanai Ward. You knew you'd lose your memories signing the pact with Shinigami, and you couldn't just enter as number one. Even though your face isn't known, your cover could be blown if you use your forte. That's why you disguised yourself as the trainee. And, of course, you ensured he would keep it a secret as well. That's how he switched places? That's just my theory, anyway. Our minds work the same way, after all. I'm sure we would come up with the same plan. <gasps> However, I'm sure he didn't expect you to come to Kanai Ward after swapping places. He arrived late on the original fifth car heading to Kanai Ward. Though a trainee, he's still a detective. He must have been wondering what happened after your agreement. But because of his promise to number one, he couldn't tell anyone about the situation. So all he could do was watch from afar. Is that why he always fled when he saw me? He must have been relieved seeing you get along with the other detectives. So he decided to make a living in this town using the special talents listed on his profile. Ultimate chef. Special talent. <laughs> I reviewed your profile in the WD. Oh, oh he yeah! could cook. <laughs> and it turns out you have a phenomenal. And ability. we couldn't cook with shit. Yeah. Ability. So oh. do you have some sort of special power too? Your record claims that you're a great cook. Would you mind making us breakfast from now on? No, oh my. <laughs> Holy shit! That's, that's the funny. truth. You realized I was number one? All because you couldn't cook. <laughs> Are you really shocked? Naturally, I knew it first Yeah, because his face. <laughs> because you and I have the same face. Dumbass. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> I'd hoped for a more heartfelt oh, that moment easy. when I finally met my original. When I but saved his life. The <laughs> case. I suppose that's because I knew you were a threat to Kanai Ward. If you knew, why didn't you do something about it? Why let us just roam free? As I said, you were useful to me until Yomi was dealt with. But more importantly, I was waiting for this moment. Waiting? To confront you here within the mystery labyrinth. What do you mean? Oh boy. Mm. I wish for you to vanish forever inside the labyrinth. Two come, two come in, only one comes out. No oh boy. No way in, no way out. <laughs> if you vanish into the mystery labyrinth, I won't have to kill you directly. Which completes my perfect crime. Just but he'll just like disappear. how you killed those yeah. other criminals. Perfect crime? With the original gone. I will become the real one. He can go back to the regular world as number one. And yeah. I will become God knows what he wants to do. Of Amaterasu Corporation and number one of the World Detective Organization. I'll be invincible. That was your goal all along? Exactly. I let you enter both the restricted area and this mystery labyrinth. Using coalescence to come here was part of my plan. Oh, so I can kill you here. That voice did not match that face. <laughs> you, you can take over the world or something. I swear every final boss is the same. <laughs> oh, not at all. With the WDO under my control, there would be no need for anyone to keep sticking their nose in our business. Can you imagine voice acting at yourself? <laughs> yeah. The mystery of Kanai Ward will forever remain a secret. I only have one wish. To protect the citizens of this city. For the homunculi of Kanai Ward to live in peace. 
I'll do anything to accomplish that. I don't care what I must sacrifice. I will protect Kanai Ward. Dude had to you record so many lines. You will <laughs> die here. Your death is necessary for Kanai Ward's peace. Better have gotten paid twice for this. <laughs> <laughs> to this city, you are the real evil, detective. I mean, kind of. If you expose the truth, to this many city, yes, we yeah. are. I won't let you do that just to satisfy your ego. Wait, we're gonna go on the whole conflict of what morality <laughs> of what dictates it because technically the people are dead. They're clones, and oh, no God is gonna get messy. You try to destroy uh -huh. this peaceful world. I'll fight back using your own brain against you. Homunculi may not be human, but they have the right to live too. I won't let anyone take that away, even if you are number one of the WDO. <sighs> it's a lot depressing. Sorry, but your plan isn't gonna work. I won't let you kill Master in this labyrinth. The real one won't just stand by, no matter what the imposter is plotting. Mm -hmm. Master? Oh, oh boy. If this is the truth. The truth I've been seeking all this time. Maybe I should Just... sacrifice myself here. What? If what he said is true, it sounds like I'm the one threatening the peace in this city. Technically, yeah. Yeah. You are finally starting to get it. Yes, that's the truth. You are a threat. Trying to destroy this wonderful world. I don't know about wonderful, mm -hmm. but... What are you saying? You discarded your pride as a detective and made a pact with a death god to go around killing people. Mm. You are dangerous. If you're not stopped, you will destroy all of Kanai Ward. That's why I must defeat you. To protect this city! He's wrong, Master! You don't need to listen to anything he says! I've reaped the souls of many criminals. I told myself their sacrifices were necessary for others to be happy. But by that logic, if I disappeared, it would be a small price to pay to protect the city's happiness, right? Who knows what he's going to do when he becomes number one, though? Which means it's my turn. I can't run away from this just because it's happening to me. I should be sacrificed for the sake of everyone else. Well, wait, Master, remember what you promised. You said you'd never turn away from the truth. That's right. But I saw the truth. I actually know what it is now. And now that I do, I've realized something. If I expose the truth about this city and tell the world... They'll be destroyed. What will happen to Kurumi and the others? They'll be destroyed. But that doesn't matter! We're in the middle of solving this mystery labyrinth! It does matter! This is their problem! I may be an outsider, but this directly affects them! Will the Yuchi go after them again? Is there any way for them to live without persecution? No. <sighs> when I think about what's best, it's obvious I should sacrifice myself. Yes, that's the correct decision. Not as a detective, but as a human being. You have no worry to speak on that. Doing that will allow no, he's saying him Kana as a human being. I, I know. In peace. Uh, uh, oh, homie, homie. What the fuck just happened? Was there supposed to be a voice line there? I think it was the fact that we wouldn't hear it because we yeah. disappeared. Uh, I don't like how dark it is. Oh. Lucy, I'm home! 
No. Oh. That's right, that little boy will die. <laughs> someone. Help people. Can't help him anymore. No. But we can help them, except for you on the right. Fuck off. Yeah. <laughs> eh, well. Which hmm. means... I... <laughs> ...have to remain here. For the good of everyone I love. Interesting. Oh Ooh. boy. Well, you know what? I think we're going to see how the. I'm going to pause this for a second because they just got to get some shit. <laughs> we are going to see how this all plays out <laughs> next time. Oh boy. This is. This is a thing that's happening. Do we make the ultimate sacrifice for the residents of Kanai Ward? Or do we face the truth and see what results that brings? Uh, nothing oh, good, man. dude. <laughs> nope. That's the stress he's on. I also want to know what the heck happened to... Because, like, oh, they got devoured, but that blood was pink. I know. I and know. Trust from Kanai Ward. I know. We might be getting trolled. Let's see what happens. Because, oh, what if... What if... What if they okay, come in through me. the door? Because they they can come in through... They can they can get here. Because we co coalesced it the with them. Maybe, but that would go against what we learned in chapter four of the fact that we can only have one coalescence at a time. Hmm. Us personally, because that was that was a whole excuse of the reason why, uh, like I said, Fubuki couldn't follow in and only Vivia was the one that followed, even though we were all there. And it's mm. because technically it was only the person that last connected. Unless they just completely redo that. But you know or what? Or maybe Fuck it, since see. this um this Mystery Labyrinth is completely different than the other ones. Maybe there's like a loophole. I don't know. Maybe. We'll have to find out. That would be really cool, though. <laughs>